Yeah. It literally could be any of them. All, all three of them are, are reasonable picks for Zave. I think most of the, like, swordsmen in this game are relatively, like, good characters. Yeah. Like, it, it's, it, I mean, we see it in Johnny. Yeah. And, like, just the ability to, like, if you play one, you can play most. Yeah. So, might as well, you know, A lot change of the, uh, the principles between the characters kind of balance between the others. Just abuse the range of the sword and yes, you're having a good time. Definitely. Robin's got a little bit more range than most, though. Yeah. Being able to poke with those thunders, like, so, so good in neutral. Mm hmm. Dash attack catching him. The scramble immediately puts him exactly where he wants to be. Oh my goodness, that ugly range of the near. Great! Oh my gosh, that was great play that from Zane! Dude, that was impeccable. Like, that mm -hmm. is risk reward 101. Mm -hmm. Instantly recognized, I'm not going to make this back unless I jump and charge that limit and then use that to take the stock. Oh, dude, dude, this is <laughs> this is smash. Yeah. Turn, that was it. <laughs> turned a really ugly situation into a beautiful one. Yeah, and now. Back, back to the neutral. Let's let's hope that he learned from that first stock. Right. But maybe don't neutral get up into arc fire. Yes. <laughs> uh, now, to be fair, at the ledge, that's where Robin thrives. It's very difficult often to deal with a lot of the situations. Dash attacks through the arc fire is pretty big. Oh, that's it. Yeah, you forced a situation where even if he does go for that recovery, he's flying straight into the cross slash. Great position. Great limit use so far from Zave. Yes, dude. Both of them have resulted in kills. That is optimal usage. Waited yes. this time. No, that's perfect. Let it singe your hands and then you'll have invincibility on the re-grab. Yep. There's, there's, there's ways around. It's like gyro. You know, mm -hmm. a lot of these moves feel oppressive, but there's ways. Yes. If you if you ignore the counterplay, it becomes a lot worse. <laughs> a lot yes. worse to deal with. And let's see. Like, Zave is, like, playing it relatively well. Just staying mm -hmm. at that distance where you can react to the spells. Except mm -hmm. there. <laughs> yeah. I mean, eventually you do have to get close enough to apply some mix. Rolls in. Great timing there. Zillion's getting a little tricky with these, like, the reverse and the arc thunders. Ooh. Hurtbox shifting from Zillion was able to duck around, get that up there, even up the stocks. Yep. Gonna mm. be right out of there. That's a big back throw sets up at the ledge. Nice patience, waits for the down air to come out first, and then you counter poke with that up air. Oop, nope, All at 11, almost back with the thunders. And there's 11, it's back. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. You go that back air sets up at the ledge. Ledge can be terrifying with Cloud as limit. Yeah, just th those extra stats that he gets just movement wise is, is, is insane. Mm, catches the movement there with the side B. Oh man, I didn't even think about that. Cloud down tilt just scooping Robin. No hitbox mm -hmm. on the way up is dangerous. It is. Doesn't get clipped by the thunder and drifts away so he doesn't land into that up air. Let's see. Good catch. What that move is so good at landing. Yeah. Hasn't two frames with the down tilt, but the dash attack. Just like, man, mm -hmm. if it goes through the arc fire and hits him, that's it. Yeah, as long as you catch that hit, a lot of what Robin wants to do off the ledge is coming from a jump, is landing with an aerial or tossing out that magic. Either way, you'll scoop up with that dash attack. Yep. Fun fact about uh, about that arc fire. Mm -hmm. If you if you just hit it while it's like coming down, like you can, mm -hmm. it just loses to most things. Yes. Um, but once it's on the ground, that's when it's hard to deal with. That's when it's very oppressive. Yes. I've I'm not sure if get up attack is one of those moves that you can use to like get rid of the arc fire as mm -hmm. it's coming. But um, we saw twice in this past game dash attack getting rid of that arc fire. Yeah. Very very well. Been very crucial. Man. Going I, back to the same stage, I don't hate it. Um, I don't like it either. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't hate it, but I. the thing is a lot of the stages that these characters like are mutual. Yeah. You know, they both love Battlefield. Um, one, of the, one of the things here that this does is tests your adaptation and says, immediately I know that I made adjustments that I needed to make, and it's not because there's a different terrain. So I don't hate it. Right now, though, Zave is staying on top of things. I know, and that's another limit that he got, like the efficiency of it. Beautiful empty land and mixes up the timing there. Normally, uh, a back air, that might have been parried even by Zillion, but gets blown up by the cross slash. Nice timing on the jump, and the drift as well gets around Zillion's aggressive options. This defensive movement and just, like, dancing around Zillion's range is like, Oh, ooh. my god, what a Thoron! Yeah, that's it, the laser. Ooh, but the up smash. Caught the roll after the backer on the shield. Beautiful pressure applied. Ooh. Yeah, both of these players are like, they're playing really clean and then catching each other with haymakers. Yes. 
And I think, like, just the fact that, I mean, Robin, most of his moves, like, they feel like haymakers, but they're yeah. they're safe. Yeah. You, you can really just kind of throw them out. Back throw again, sets up this ledge trap. That limit movement is going to help him get away. That was such a big catch, but no follow-up. Yeah. Zay's pressing his buttons. Stuck here. Okay, that does punish the roll. What a parry. There you go. Let's see on the ledge that caught back air, but the <laughs> Robin forward air can meet that range. Mm -hmm. And the timing there is going to catch you getting caught with that neutral get up again. Don't get up into the fire. <laughs> no, it, it, it doesn't work. Not always. That shreds the shield. Let's see. Oh, nice. my, so Trump. fast. Mm -hmm. But the buffer from Zillion made it really difficult to find an actual clean punish. Up tilt catches the landing. See. Retreats to the ledge. Still no down air. He's getting close. I think it's just yeah. a little too late. There, jumps right over the thunder, gets a clean helm splitter, and catches the hand. Dude, Zay's limit use is so good. He's Very getting nice. most of them. He's missed at most like two out of five. Been very nice. Again, empty lands the cross slash. That's a ton of damage, and limit is back. Ooh, but SDI'd right out of it. Yeah, just get that extra damage while you got it. Just getting out the arc fire again. Ooh, ducks under the back air, so he's not going to find a clean punish. But look at the chase from Zayd. He is not letting Zillion get away with the, without a hitch. Yeah, and every back air is just a bit more percent. Oh, Again, man. just barely missing these downers. That could be the game winning and the set winning downer. Let's see. Up air juggles. Nice empty land there. Almost caught the jump to the platform. Ooh, gotta be careful with these jumps. Those mm -hmm. Robin aerials are huge and fast. <sighs> this is huge, oh, but he doesn't gosh. have the punish. Oh man, Robin just didn't have something fast enough to punish. Mm -hmm. Both players at crazy high percent. The forward air, di properly is not going to kill. He has no dodge, but there was no way for Zillion to pressure. Oh, what a swing. Helm splitter. Ooh, with a dash attack? Yes. Yeah, applies that pressure, backs up immediately, and then goes straight for a hit. That, like, dash attack is such a good tool, I feel, against zone breakers. It, Definitely. It's, it's quick, it's strong. Quick, strong. It really it's, beats out a lot of projectiles. It's like, got it a good like. range just a little bit above them, so it punishes those people trying to come down with an aerial um, or you know, just setting up in that like 45 degree above you. It's one. Of, I feel like it's one of the better moves to use that like you know that instant dash attack just yeah. tech where you could just kind of throw it out instantly. It's hard to react and, to, I feel like, and it has some pretty long reach. Yeah, good burst range. Beautiful play all around, honestly. That was, dude, it, like saves movement, mm -hmm. like... Like every like, I see that wave land. I'm like, oh, you're not you're not just flexing. You're kind of using you're it. You're actually and, uh, intelligently like, using this movement option. I, I love it. It, yeah. it. it makes the game look a lot faster than it feels sometimes, and yeah. that's I can appreciate as as a watcher. So yeah. great stuff. Um, Zillion though, may, maybe you could just switch characters off of the cloud. I feel like it's hard because mm -hmm. Cloud's back air is a really hard move to yeah. deal with, uh, especially there was, on the ledge. There's a couple of moments where. I feel like most of Zave's openings were just a timing thing. So if Zillion's just a little bit mixed up off of that beat, then suddenly things turn around quite a bit. Yeah. Uh, and there was a couple, you know, back and forth where sometimes Zillion was a little bit off on the timing, sometimes Zave was a little bit off on the timing, and, you know, back and forth there, but Zave just ended up coming out on top with it. I know. Look, look at us being like, don't neutral get up into the arc fire, and then he's just SDIing right <laughs> out of it. Just, we're just like, oh, 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 okay. Yeah. <laughs> maybe do that, I guess. <laughs> yeah, maybe do that. Um, I, it really, at the end of the day, I feel like Zave just applied the pressure and made Zillion guess more than Zillion made Zave guess. And with limit too. Yeah. Like throwing out that like neutral B limit blade beam was a really good option a lot of the time, and it hit. Yeah. I don't think he missed a single blade beam. Yeah, it was a uh, pretty nice, pretty nice. When your limits hit like that, oh, yeah. it does so much damage and knockback and shield pressure. If, and it, if you have that success rate on hitting your limits and you're not winning the set, something went wrong. Yes, you're like, I, I, I don't yeah. even know 